It's time for Chris and the Donnas. Hello, and welcome to the second port of call on our Virgin Voyages Valiant Lady Western Caribbean Charm Cruise. This is Costa Maya on the eastern coast of Mexico's Yucatan Peninsula. We visited Costa Maya on two previous cruises in 2018 and 2021. On the original itinerary, Costa Maya was our first scheduled port of call. We experienced a delay on our first sea day due to a helicopter evacuation for a medical emergency. Cozumel, Mexico became the first port of call on the revised itinerary and pushed Costa Maya to become the second port of call. Roatan, Honduras was removed from the itinerary with the addition of Cozumel, Mexico. There is a shuttle available on the Costa Maya Pier. As the Mexican flag flaps in the breeze, the Costa Maya sign welcomes guests ashore. Tourists take in sights of a colorful mural on a seawall and the jagged coastline with Royal Caribbean's Voyager of the Seas approaching the port on the horizon. Take the opportunity to pose with this sign when you visit Costa Maya. Guests can book and take tours from Costa Maya or they can hang out in the resort and enjoy the amenities like pools, bars, restaurants, and shops. Because this is our third visit to Costa Maya, I decided to check out the other ships in port while the Donna stayed aboard. The Carnival Jubilee docked perpendicular to the Virgin Voyages Valiant Lady, while the Carnival Celebration docked parallel to us on the opposite side of the pier. Costa Maya is busy with three ships already in port as Royal Caribbean's Voyager of the Seas sails closer. Cruise ship enthusiasts wait with great anticipation of seeing this ship dock parallel to the Carnival Jubilee. Here are some close-ups of the Carnival Jubilee, Virgin Voyages Valiant Lady, and Carnival Celebration. It is remarkable to see cruise ships docking in port. No doubt the process is complex and requires technical skill and expertise to maneuver these large vessels. These ships are so close to each other. After watching all the activity on the pier, I return to our ship to rejoin the Donnas for a selfie and a refreshing cocktail. We pass by a juice bar as we return to our cabin to watch more pier activity from our terrace. Later in the evening, we depart from Costa Maya. As we sail away, we enjoy a beautiful sunset. Royal Caribbean's Voyager of the Seas departs from Costa Maya. Don't forget to like this video by giving it a thumbs up. 
Leave a comment below to let us know what you think. If you're not a subscriber, click the red subscribe button below. And keep up with our latest videos by clicking the notification bell. Thank you for watching. Be sure to check out these other videos and we'll see you next time.